Welcome to another episode of them late nights and them wet wipes. You know who this is, man. I took a couple weeks, a little hiatus, had some business to attend to, but I'm back. Where you been? Taking, I had, I had another Black Brotherhood lecture. <laughs> I had, I had, I had to do a top up from the summer, just top myself, get winter edition, make sure that I'm educated, make sure that yeah. I'm so conscious. What did, what, did you, what did you learn? I learned that we can't take the struggle for granted. I'm just putting extra cu- a couple of extra CCs in that backside blood. Yeah, you 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 can call it that, but just know that this this Cultural brain capital is is is, 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 is he's conscious. I went, went turkey. Hey man, I saw a brother get a not that neither of you need it a, a beard transplant. You know they do that now as well. Is it? Yeah, man. Not just the top; they can get you a beard as well. Actually, maybe that's what um allegedly Conor Ben got on that. Mm. Be a, transplant. a lot of every there's a lot of allegedly re- regarding that guy. Yeah. After the year he's had. Anyway, yeah, anyway, <laughs> let's introduce you guys have spoken, so they know you're about, but let's introduce my guy to the left. Uh, get get uh get your boots. Get your uh um... <laughs> <laughs> early fumbles. Early fumbles. Fill your boots as much as possible with that noise, cause in seven episodes. Going away. You retire in it? Yeah, after the after a year. Was that how I said a year? Did I say a year or a hundred episodes? I can't remember. I think you said a year. Yeah, yeah. Is it a new noise covered or TBC. 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 But you don't know who it is, man, because he's more aka Thomas Skengley, aka leader of the Peaky Bumble Clutch. You don't know. Nines is younger, plot of papers and younger. Man, have they claimed you yet? You've been saying this for a few episodes. Have, have just... those two guys claimed you? You can't be claiming can I... they're younger. <laughs> <Can> I... <laughs> I... <laughs> No, 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 you don't. No, can, can I finish my intro real quick? Okay. <laughs> AKA nine pieces of paper, but if you see me in house, then just call me 4.5. You're done, no. <laughs> Big heap, small heap every time. <laughs> okay, now you've, have they claimed you? Listen. <laughs> 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 that told me all I need to know. Nah, listen, <laughs> this, is, this is the streets we're talking about. Yeah. Yeah, so... Man, 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 man's not going to chat about that. <laughs> Are you comfy in Halsden and Barkham, respectively? Don't know. <laughs> how, how, how much younger than someone do you have to be to be their younger? One year. Is this one year? Mm-hmm. I don't know. Yeah, they, they don't, obviously mm-hmm. there's no street codes, but... Because I feel like you should I, I've, be I've like... seen people who are older be the younger. Oh dear. Yeah. That's, That's them funky man ends though, where he's from. Okay, all right. Let's they do funky it. business over there, man. You need to come. I'm not talking about where you're from. I'm not talking about where you reside now. No, I'm I know not... I know you're talking about South. I know you're talking about no, South. No, 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 I'm not talking about South. What are you talking about? I'm talking about a specific area. But if you're older than Willich. I don't know. Is that where you're from? I don't know. What I'm doing right now yeah. is making sure no ends is onto me. I know, I know you're trying, you're trying to, but then you, you can't say you're my man's younger. I can't. Because you've got beef with certain areas. And I'm beefed those areas then. All right. Well, who are you beefing? Stonebridge. <laughs> Is that going to make the edit? <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> <laughs> this is a parenting podcast you're talking about. You shout that ends. What's wrong with you? I still go around there, push back. Kevin don't even know what my hood looks like. Who's Kevin? And Perry go large, I don't know. Kevin is K-Coke. Ah. Mm. Him and Nine's beef. Is it? Yeah, oh yeah. Oh, they're both really good rappers. Nope, one is. Hey, to the left, to the left. 
Oh, so I see what you're saying. See, see what's doing. See what's doing. Uh, hey, RC Bill pays permission. Who's that? It's me. It's Darren G. Darren Griffiths, your mum's best friend. Hey, come on. How's it going, fellas? <laughs> I just want to disclaimer, yeah? If any man from the ends are still watching, I don't have beef with anyone. I don't back no beef. I don't have no beef. I don't want no beef. Yeah? Hey. I'm vegan, cuz. Hey. When I'm still trying to get over the idea of someone being an old... Wait. An older, you'll be, yeah, you'll be yeah. A younger, yeah, yeah. You're older than that person. Yeah, but if the older guys watch, watch, they can't count for him. Nah, and it's not about age. It's no. about like if you're if you're not thirty, you'll rather be yeah, the younger that, of someone and build up your a, own name. That's a big sign of you to come off the road. Absolutely. Well, some people are trying to like, hang on. Imagine, no, imagine you've been on the road for twenty years. Yeah, and just new people coming, and you're just there younger. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You don't you don't level up. Like, like you're, you're basically chameleon. Yeah, like, like it's a proper like work organization. You're having your appraisal. Yeah. At the end of the year. Dead. And they're like, yeah, you ain't moved enough. You ain't moved enough back. Yeah, you ain't put enough work in. You ain't put enough work in. So, listen, younger stabber, man. <laughs> That's what he, happened in Payton Hall. He's no older stabber, man. He's like, no, but I thought I was going to be older stabber. No, no, now you're, now you're, 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 you're younger you're this guy now. You're, ti- you're younger this guy now. You're, 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 you're a little miss. You should still keep, you should still keep the name, but you <laughs> should just, just go down. The, you know what it's called? Like the, your famo. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. Just go, so you're not it's even younger. Now. You're like, you're like, um, so Little you're like the youngest, tiny, you're tiny. like the youngest tiny, so you're tiny younger stabber man. <laughs> Bad prefixes. Also, can I just say that the reason I put that disclaimer in, yeah, that I don't beef no one or ends, yeah, mm-hmm. is because I don't want to have to edit and <laughs> take it out. That's, that's... Oh, oh, you want to, you want to, you're, you're standing on business. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's facts. I don't beef no one. Yeah. And I also don't want to edit. Yeah, fair enough. It's fair, yeah, fair enough. You, you don't have to edit if you don't want to. Let, let's, but let's... I city Jews win our pity. Oh, right, man. Doing. Okay, he's still continuing. What? Let, let's get let's get straight into the listeners' question. Yeah, they're not gonna see this anyway. Let, let's 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 appreciate uh, our, get, our guy. I got Nathan. Yes, is always checking in, sharing Nate love all the dog. time. We appreciate he from? you every time, Nathan. Hmm. What area? Did Go you on? say gone in? No. no, 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 no. You no, hearing no, things? No, no. What are you, yeah. you smoking? No countries were said. Ops. Are you? Are you? Are you okay? He's smoking ops. This guy. <laughs> <laughs> it's not country. Oh, I'm in real beef. <laughs> what? I'm in real beef. Oh, okay. And I say his name on the pod. No, Big Rich. V-A-R. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stick, stick, stick Parents. to parity. <laughs> yeah, we're not, we're, we're, yeah <laughs> let's stay, let's stay on topic. <laughs> Thank you, VAR. Oh, There's yeah. a lot of talk about VAR, but that was very well used. Yeah, Shout cool. out, Nathan. Thank you. Hey, man. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> the people need to listen to one voice. Sorry. Nathan, shout out Nathan every time, man. Uh, he's got a parent in Dynamo for us to consider. Yes. All right, fellas, I recently got a kitten. My youngest has become mad jealous of the cat. So much so, he keeps picking him up and not leaving him alone and has on occasion hit the cat. Shout out Kurt Zuma. What would you do to stop your kid turning on the cat? Also, I'm not sure it's relevant, but we call the cat a cunt in an Australian <laughs> accent fairly frequently in front of the kids. <laughs> this is his personal dilemma. And yeah. That's the personal one he, he wrote into us. He wants us to solve. <laughs> he's got he's got a kid that's mad jealous of the kitten. So let's let's, how let's, let's dress it one by one. <laughs> so, well, I don't know how old the, the child is, but let's just say the child's about four or five ish, I think. Because I remember he had, Nathan had a dilemma earlier, and I think that was age. I mean, yeah, do you actually, do you actually know him? No, he's a listener. Yeah, he's just, listener. just just submit the question. Yeah, what, but what's like, going he on? He messages like pick him up. We what? did. I don't. Let's answer his question. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why is everyone onto me if I get my oldest here? <laughs> yeah, like, look. Why, why are you so off topic today? <laughs> what's that <happening? laughs> How how many? So let's say let's assume Nathan's child is five, yeah. and he's bad. He's now jealous of a feline. So this is what you got to do, right? There's two entities in the house. Okay. Yep. Okay. Now, yeah. You have like obviously the thing you love the most comes first. So you have to get rid of the kid. <laughs> <laughs> Keep the cat. <laughs> you might you might imagine that. You might imagine going to the adoption center. You you're with your partner, you got the cat there, you got the kid, and then like well, what's going on? I said he's gotta go. <laughs> he's gotta go. And, and then his why? cat cleans itself. 
pisses and shits in the right area. I was just thinking about you bringing a kid to, the, to social services in the little cat box. <laughs> <laughs> and, then, and the kid's like this. <laughs> <laughs> You're feeding the kid whiskers. I think, at that point, I think at that point, social service will be like, <laughs> we'll take good it. choice. We'll take <laughs> but, um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know how, how do you, um, I guess... I know one thing you meant to do when you've got like an older sibling, a young sibling, the old one's like jealous is to give them responsibilities to do with the younger sibling. So you oh. can maybe do that with the cat to give them responsibilities. Yeah, but the th- he's, he's, he's clapping the cat on sight. He's just giving it a one little one too. So yeah, I, I, we, he's, he's we trust what it's what a jealousy thing, isn't it? So he thinks that you're going to get, you're, you're going to favour the cat over the kid. So if you make the kid realise, nah, you're important. Like we need you to Help take care of the cat. Yeah, but then that's how you know. It's like, oh yeah, go 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 and feed the cat some whiskers, and he's giving it a, a little one too. Listen, what you got to do is you got to sit down the kid and say, look, this is a, this is an animal. Yeah. yeah, it has feelings. You can't hit the cat, all right? Especially because you can get a two hundred and fifty thousand pound fine for doing <laughs> such things. But let's say he's like my favorite player is Kurt Zuma, and Kurt did it, and you know he's still playing for West Ham, so there's no consequence. Exactly, he's actually. playing for West Ham. So if I kick the cat, case I closed. West Ham. <laughs> no, case closed. Do you want to play for West Ham? Ugh. Well, it's better, it's better than... He'd be like, before you did that, you played for Chelsea. <laughs> <laughs> and France. So, so he can say what? <clears throat> nah, man. I don't know, man. Just fucking stop... Ki- just stop hitting the cat, innit? Yeah. The, the, just I mean, stop hitting the cat. Feel like abuse is, I mean, is not good. Cats... Because the cat's going to claw your face That's off. what I say. C- cats do... Yeah, that's what The cat starts responding. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. When that cat's had enough, you're finished. Yeah, cause one and the cats are quick, you know. One, two, they'll give you. A, and a cats one, two are cut. cats will what like cats will act all friendly, friendly, friendly until you're asleep and you're just that one paw just and it's watching you sleep, yeah. And when you go, oh fucking fuck you, and you're done your dance, bro. I, I, I can't lie, I'm more scared of cats than dogs, you know. Well, it depends on a dog. Depends on a dog. No, obviously, if it's uh, let's say like if would you, would you rather if you had to pick what you're gonna get the tussle with? What are you saying, an ex or bully? Or a feline. A cat. I'll, f- I'll pick a cat. Yeah, easy. It's like a cat easy over an ex old bully. I'll, I'll pick the cat 100%. Yeah. Oh, boy, uh, there's some of these felines out here. You're, scary, you're picking an ex old bully. <laughs> you're fighting an ex old bully. Like, over a cat. Yeah, I'll take an ex old bully by a cat. Because I, you know what? what? You would take what an ex old bully. What the hell kind of cats are you seeing? No, because the, the thing, the ex old bully, obviously, they look mad aggressive. I oh, agree. he's African. He's talking about lions. No, I'm not. <laughs> Yeah, so where where are you from? This guy, you always yeah. calling me that. Where are you from? I I used to work with this girl from Zambia, yeah, and she's Racist. she was cussing Nigerians a Nigeria, right? She was saying that uh, you have no wildlife in Nigeria <laughs> because you like ate them all. Hey, listen, <laughs> we have we have wildlife every time a Zambia <laughs> steps foot over the border. That's what she said. Oh, she said, you, said no, you don't flip flop. <laughs> <flip-flop. laughs> That's what she said. Woo! She, she said, that was the Zambians. Yeah, wait, 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 on my BBO, I learned we're not meant to fight each other. That's what I learned. Come on. Zambia, even in Africa. Oh my goodness. Oh. The cat. Yeah, I don't know how he thinks he can fight. No, but no, 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 obviously a big extra bully. They obviously look me, but it's just it's more... not a look. They are. Yeah, I know they yeah, are. They've they literally been bad by the government. Yeah, yeah. and and, and they're good. going to Rwanda. They've been sent to Rwanda. <laughs> the Rwanda will deal with them. Don't worry. But the thing is, with the cat, I just I don't know what they're capable of. That's the thing. I, I leave extra bully. I Scratches. know. I know what they're capable. Of, but these cats, it's just the the quick movement will scare cats me. Cats are capable of very. The thing is, yeah, a cat will murk you. And then bounce. A dog's not stopping. Yeah. That lockjaw hits your ankle, fam. I, do you know what? I it's thought lockjaw was a thing, but then like I, when I started fam. Googling, apparently lockjaw is like a, a myth that's just been pet- perpetuated. Like they, there's no mechanism in of their jaw that enables it to lock. That's what I heard. Spud me, spud no, me. no, you're gonna do you're gonna do some I, fuckery. I'm no, gonna move it. Spud no. me, spud me, spud me, spud me, spud me. So no, keep it there, keep it yeah. there. So when you're when you're locked up, yeah, me and Darren are just gonna say it's a myth and walk off. Yeah. Me and Darren catch you locked up by an ex old bully. Yeah. Well, you wouldn't back it. I'll no, say, no, you just, say, I'll just, say it's just a myth. Open, open his mouth. Just open his mouth, bro. Just open his yeah. mouth, bro. Yeah, I will. Open yeah. his mouth. Well, you have to help me. No, no, right. no, no. No. Mm-hmm. It's a myth. No. No, no. Yeah, me and Kazim are going to fight the two cats yeah. that are there. And yeah, yeah, fight, yeah, yeah. And the cat's going to fuck you up. And then what? And now. No, I know. I think the cat's will fuck We're in the hospital. And I've just got a few scratches on my arm. 
and, and the, the cats are dead, jab. by the way. Yeah, the cats are, what, what, the cats are absolutely skull fuck crushed. Why, why, are they, why are they dead? Because we, we just killed fucked them. them up You just fucked them up? Okay. Fuck the so you're up. confident you're, you're going to fuck up these cats? Yes. yes. Okay, all right, cool. You're like, Compared to an XL bully? XL bully, I feel like... No, I'm really confident. Hold on a sec. Can we just deep yeah. the fucking dog's name? This <laughs> Extra large bully. Yeah, that, that's, that's the name. <laughs> you think you could take that on? Come on. What's this cat called? Mittens. Nah, nah, nah. Let, 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 let's I'm, get... I'm let, let, let's, I'm let's give it a research name. reference here. Like, you know... XL bullies have literally been bad. I know they've been bad. I, 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 they I don't are. doubt they're dangerous. So that's the but, fact. But I'm that's more the scared of, of XL bullies. I don't know what a, a cat's wholly capable of. But that's this, what I'm saying. What do you think you're going to do? You 100% know what a cat's capable of. Nah, I'm, I'm, that, they that's scratch. the fear. Yeah, I know they scratch, but they could have... So you're scared of cats. That's what it is. This is the explanation of this. For nearly a month... I looked after my neighbour's cat. Every day, I had to go and feed and water that feline. And I would even walk in sometimes, and then sometimes the cat would look at me at the top of the stairs, you know, late, and then walk down, and then start eating the food that I put out and go drink the water. But the cat never never touched me. I ain't scared of the That's cat. That's because you used like, to open the door to throw food down <laughs> the side of the door. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just bare, just bare the cat, whiskers just up the wall. <laughs> the cat never left the box. <laughs> Michael said, "You live, you, you live here now in the box. You live in the box, in George. That cat, that cat was chopping. I thought yeah. that cat good. For that cat good, good. Did feed, you so, feed it, John. Uh, we, nah, some, I don't know what feline food it had, man. It's just some necks. Can't believe it, it was chopping it though. Take on an XL, is it? This is, Look, man. I, if you had a choice between an XO, it's not like you're going XO bully and Rottweiler, and you've gone fuck it. I just pick one. I'll pick the toughest one just so I go out with a bit of pride. I'm just saying, man. I'm just saying. Some of these cats can be scary, so we need to warn Nate, Nate, Nathan's child to take it easy because these cats. A cat will tricks. scratch your shit up, yeah, but you you you'll be okay. You'll heal. You get me. And also, if they the, the, if a dog mashes you up, you've got a, like you you're gonna you have a cleft lip or something. If they, if they, if they, they catch you, stitch if they catch you lacking. But then if you listen to all these dog owners, you know, these dogs are calm. You know, they're calm. They're, it's the owner's That's fault. That's fine. You but know. I'm there's, calm. But there's stories well, if you try of and the fight dog. Me, there's stories of videos yeah. of the dog not being calm. I've never seen a video of a domestic cat fucking someone up at a bus stop. Like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what the best point is? The best point is, yeah. Right. <laughs> First of all, just, just if you had to guess, even if you don't know, just name me some dogs that, you know, they have to be kept on the lead in public areas. All dogs have to. No, not all dogs. Nah. What do you mean all? I thought every no, no, no. dog. Not all dogs. Need, what do you mean all? Some dogs. So a cocker spaniel or whatever. Yeah, no, some, do, some dogs are just mad, dumb and playful. Yeah. Some so dogs. I thought by law, all dogs. No, no, no. There's what? certain dogs you have to keep on the lead. And uh, by a Rottweiler. that. Rottweiler. Okay. Uh, obviously, you're talking about XL Bully. Um, Pitbull. Can you get them yeah. still? Bulldogs? Can you get them still? Um, a bulldog? No. Can't yeah, get them. Uh, no, you can get a bulldog. A bulldog. Oh, I thought there's. A, I thought before XO bulldog was like a little fat thing. Yeah? Yeah. But I thought there was, there like was a staff, pitbull, yeah, Rottweiler. Pitbull, maybe the pitbull. Yeah. Well, one you can't get. You get. You get on a lead. Now, just okay. Let me land on this. Yeah. Okay. Now, name me some dogs that you've seen in your personal life that have muzzles on. Maybe Pitbull. Right, so that's on the, that's again. Yeah. yeah. I've seen muzzles on Rottweiler's stuff, so that, yeah. yeah. All right, now, cool. All right, cool. Now, name me a cat that you have to keep on the lead. Mm. <laughs> I ain't seen one. You, you, okay. you, you don't keep cats on the lead. Okay, <laughs> okay cool. Uh, okay. Uh, name me a cat that you've seen that needs a muzzle. I've never seen a muzzle on a cat. Okay, cool. And th- forgive me if I'm wrong, like, majority of cats... <clears throat> They're just allowed to just uh, just roam around, leave, come back, leave, come yeah, back. Yeah, they don't yeah. need an owner with them. All like the they have a, either the flap. They have a flap. Yeah, they, yeah, just, they yeah. come in. They come yeah. in as they please. How many times have you seen "Beware of the cat signs" in a window, <laughs> or any you know, Malcolm and Wise type sketches where postman runs away from a cat? No. Have you ever seen a cat be used to guard a premises before? Yeah. <laughs> Hey, Do so, you see so, where I'm going with so, this? But, but I just want you of the to give the right advice to your child, right? <laughs> About what? About cats and dogs? Just, just life. Just, I don't want you to have your... Tell your son, it's like, if you see a cat cross the road, yeah. it's like, and there's a mad pit bull on the yeah, other side of the road. Do you know what I've never seen a in, a, in a drill or rap video? 
fucking cap. They should do though. <laughs> see, they see that's a sketch right there, right there. They should do. Because the cats are the guardians of the, the only underworld. Cat, and I'm scared of the underworld. The no, only it's not. Cat. Cerberus is the three headed dog. Is it? Yeah. I thought it was cats. Nah. Cerberus, three headed dog. So, dog. Dog. <laughs> D O G. It's a dog. Yeah, there you go. Point proven. The only cat you should be afraid of is Tom. Shout out Jerry. But. Because that cat's on badness. You know, he's on, he's, on, he's on stupidness. But then anytime that dog came, <laughs> he, he, was, he was shook himself. There you go. But just because Tom is scared of a dog doesn't mean I should be scared of the dog. But, I'm not but saying why I'm scared, scared of the cat. bad man cat yeah. that you wouldn't fight is scared of the dog that you would fight. I'm not saying dogs aren't scary. You guys are, are misconstruing no, what I'm No, I'm not. Saying. I'm definitely not. I'm not. I'm you not would saying... take on a dog, an ex old bully, rather than a cat. Because I don't know what the cat's capable of. I know what the dog's capable of. Oh, Mad. Do you know what I feel like? I feel like I'm talking to one of the dudes where I work. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you say that one of these guys in the detention center or something like that. No, so, I don't work there, bro. So. <laughs> Us, so what, what are we tell uh, Nathan? Us, Nathan us, Nathan. Let, 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 let's summarise. Get a, Nathan, get a dog you get... and let your kid fuck the dog up because <laughs> nothing bad will happen. Your, your kid could probably take the dog. Bang! Look, man. <laughs> and if you can handle a dog, by the, these guys' logic, you can handle anything. So yeah. go ahead. Is that sort of get an XL bully. Get an XL get bully. XL Before bu- the government <laughs> banned them, get one of them because they're probably going cheap now because people are trying to probably get rid of them. Get an XL bully and let your son tame the bully. No mm-hmm. muzzle, no lead. So if he tames the ex or bully, he can probably tame the bullies that were trying to bully your son at school. There we go, full circle. Yeah, Wait, when, who was trying to bully your son? No, you were in the episode. I can't do nothing about that. You were there. You were present. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's let's go I, into some. Have you ever got any reflections? Any personal stories? Um, I'm going to speak. Yep. I hate. Um, <laughs> well, it was funny. I was sorry. So I was um, I'm gonna speak. <laughs> I'm gonna speak. Uh, do you know I don't like? I don't like safe SIPs, safety induced purchases. Stuff do you have to purchases? Move? Yeah. Oh, what are they? Stuff you have to buy. I got a reflection section. Let's see if it tags. Safety on induced SIP stuff oh. you got to buy for the safety of your child. Not so long ago, we've been trying to encourage my son to to crawl on the stairs. Yeah. Like sometimes we we'll, like we. We'll, There'll be a letter he wants to. It's on the third step from the bottom. He'll be reaching, he'll grab it. And then I'll put it on the fourth step to try and encourage him and stuff. Yeah. He won't do it. Not so long ago, usually we let him just call downstairs. He's never shown any interest going up the stairs. I went upstairs to start changing. My message was downstairs. I come out, I see this boy on the landing. I'm thinking, what the hell? I think the same thing. <laughs> no! Same no! thing. No! 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 Am I going crazy? Why? No! Similar no! to what happened to this motherfucker. Didn't, didn't, didn't. Fucking cut that out of the episode, man. Oh, <laughs> yeah, you didn't say? You didn't say? You held it down. You... Fuck. I'm done for. If the boy's fine. Why did you cut out? We even told you not to. Any... I've got a sofa, I can sleep on. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> hey, man, shout out to Sharia every time. Sorry. Yo! Oh, sorry, my bad. I didn't know. I don't know. No, I, don't know. I don't know. I don't know. You, you, you said, said it last time. Like, I don't know. I'm all over the place. <laughs> Get me back to Holston. Get me back to Holston. Okay, you said it like I, I watched the episode back and you said it. Get me back to Holston. <laughs> Get me back to Holston. <laughs> you, you had to be this guy splattered. doesn't know where he is. Yeah, you, you had to be splattered. <laughs> so, and I was like, I, mean, that, I saw that. I said, we need safety gate. That is a set, SIP. That's a, now a safety induced purchase. That's not a purchase that was in my mind. Yeah. Now, because the safety is induced on me, I can't. I I cannot not buy a, a gate now. It'll be coming sooner or later, though. Yeah, but it's annoying though, because like it's not something I've factored in. I yeah. think it's more. It's more that. It's more just like a. But you knew it was coming. No, see, see I... Well, so I I I know people have used them in the past and stuff. Like going to people's houses with kids, I've seen them. So I'm not gonna act like I've never seen a safety gate. But it's more just like it's probably it was like on the back burner. Like even my missus mentioned, oh, we may have to get front facing. Uh, car seat. And I was like, oh, okay, that's that's something that we're gonna have to do. But yeah. now we're seeing him on the landing. On the, I was like, we need to get this like imminently. Yeah. Mm. Sort of like when he was in his crib, like he, the crib he was born with, so to speak. His line flat. Then when he's like standing, I was like, okay, we need to convert it to a cot. This is the SIP safety induced purchase. We need now to get him because he's gonna topple over if you don't get him. So that like one of those ones. Now I don't know how much these gates are. But I'm gonna have to look at. Oh, uh, yeah, get one. Plus forty-five, fifty. Yeah. So you, it's just you one just of the make sure you got the right uh, size, size and setup. 
round your stairs, whatever you think, where you think you're going to attach it to and stuff. Mm. So like, I'm good. Could you you two have probably put these up now? No, I've, yeah. I've got a I've got a uh, trap house safety gate basically. So, so but like the rubber. No, nah, I bought two cots. Yeah. To you, boy starts tending up. Needed it deeper. Cot. So the SIP. Yeah. And so we bought the cot. I put it up. One of the things weren't screwing in properly, yeah? yeah. Mm. I go on IKEA website, there's like, yeah. My, I go to IKEA, first of all, and they're like, we ain't got, we ain't got the... The part. Because the, the thing had actually now... Um, it was oh. worn away, so I couldn't uh, twist it. Yeah. Um, so they go, we haven't got it in. We can order it. It takes like 10 days or some shit. I was like, I ain't got 10 days. So I bought another one, yeah? Mm. Put that one up, and then we just had this cot that was... Dismantled just parts. <laughs> so we just took one of the sides with the bars, yeah. and the way our stairs is set up is that like the banister is like there's a chunk of wood, yeah. then mm. a little gap, then another chunk of wood. Yeah. But mm. not the banister, that the yeah, the p- pillar. Yeah, yeah. And we just slid that gate thing in there, the side of the cot, mm. and we just slide it back and forth. Oh, but it makes sense because you don't call around upstairs. We only put it at the bottom of the stairs. Mm. See, there we go. But that, that's what it's just a barrier of some thought, and you really paid for it anyway. So, you know, yeah. so make it happen. Our one's, our one's budge. But it's doing the job? Yeah. Boom blast. Yeah. Yeah, see, I wasn't expecting because my, because like Zadie was a weird kid in the sense of you told her don't touch something, she said, all right, and Jeez. just left it. That's where it evolved. So, we didn't baby oh proof, we didn't baby proof our house. I think that's all. girls. Maybe. Because uh, Sheree said she didn't have to baby proof before. No, but now she nothing. Yeah, but well, this guy started. This guy, he's now he, he's he's crawling now. Yeah, he's on a um, and yeah, he's he's active. Mm, like these boys plugs, are active, man. weights, wires, vacuum cleaner. The map, just leave him for a second. Do, do, do. <laughs> and he's just under something. So like, Jesus. <laughs> so it's just like, yeah, we're gonna have to just baby proof everything, but yeah. He's just finding new ways to try and kill himself, this guy. Yeah. And the bad yeah. thing is, is that he can sleep on his front and he's totally fine, but he still hasn't developed the mechanism that if you throw something on his face to take it off. Oh, yeah. Like, no, yeah, you throw like, like just, you know, like a, just a sheet on his face just to see what he does. He just... He thinks he's drowning or something. Uh, 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 uh. It's just like, just grab it. Just take it off your face. It's like, please, save yourself. Save I'm yourself. not always going to be here, son. Yeah. He's like, I need to know if something drops on your face, you just pull it off. But he's just like, uh, 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 uh. I'll show you guys a video when Zadie threw something on his head. The guy just... He it lost it. Spun around, fell back on his head and just... just, 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 just. <laughs> My son would just be... Just fling it off. Yeah. He, he, he was... A master at throwing things early doors. So mm. as soon as something touched it, like put a hat on him, it's off. Right, yeah. Throw his muzzy on him, it's off. Mm. If anything's in his way when he's crawling, I think I told you, in sync with his crawl. Just like, boom, 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 <laughs> and it's gone. <laughs> in sync. In stride. Yeah, he doesn't break us. Doesn't break stride. Hey, he pulls, efficiency. He pulls everything off. If you're asleep, you'll open your eyes. Uh, I think I think that must be boys then. Yeah. It must it must be a boy it's thing. Yeah, yeah. Oh. chaos merch. Kay- oh, he loves yeah. it. It's bad is that plug. Problem. Yeah. And he's looking at me. Like my son. Fuck it. He I like because he used he <laughs> so we'd say. He uses it in the right context, yeah. Yeah. So my son can somewhat say, What's that? Right. Right? Mm. So he'll just pick stuff up. What's that? He likes the phone. But then when we got to the plug socket, he'd be like, what's that? And you're like, the end of your life. Uh, <laughs> it's, like, it's like, you do not need to be involved. Yeah. Yeah. And he's like, it's not so I'm you. like, no. And he's like, what's that? Because <laughs> <laughs> he's been right back. And I'm like, I made him cry. I made him cry yesterday. Yeah. Man's obsessed with the washing machine. Oh, yeah. It's, oh, it's yeah. Same, same, same man. I want to tell him, bro, keep looking at him. I'll put you in there. <laughs> yeah. If that washing machine is odd, he, he can sit there just kind of just... Oh, no, like he's not TV. obsessed with the washing machine being on. Yeah. He's obsessed with the the m- mechanics of it. Like, man's all turning the dial. Oh, like. that's that's oh. Yeah, he's like, that's, what is that's, that? That's Sadie. Yeah. Boop, Touch boop, everything. Boop, boop, boop. It just makes noise, doesn't it? And open... Mm. Nah, but it's off. Oh, she can switch it on. Uh, she's actually... So, s- so she oh, turns wow. everything off 
yeah. at the mains. Right, right, yeah. Oh, yeah. to not mess about. Yeah, not give him a chance. No, no. That's just her OCD. Oh, okay, what? On a, on a Martin Lewis save an expert sort of thing? No. <laughs> she just turns no. everything off. Yeah. Fucks me off. Yeah? Because <laughs> you, right, you're you're you want a quick cup of tea. Hey, hey to, and I, I know you're fucking listening. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> She came up to me the other day. You know the episode the other day didn't have, have a video. I said, yeah, I, I edited the thing. I told you on the train at Liverpool that it's not, it's not working. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna pay for that. Um, so yeah, he's but he likes the, the door to open on the yeah. washing machine and close it. And even that's got like a hinge. Yeah. He's like, I'm gonna open it and close it as many times as I can. Yeah. yeah? So he's standing by the thing, and I'm telling him no. And my voice is getting deep. I'm going no, and then you just see his belly go. <laughs> He just turns around, looks at me dead in the eye. <laughs> I'm busting up laughing. Oh, I'm like, but you listen a, though. But I'm like, it's a washing machine. Yeah. You get me? Is that a toy? Mm. Yeah. <laughs> like, what are you doing? You've got hella toys. So many toys. Yeah, yeah. You've got so yeah. many toys, but for some reason, you like the plug socket, my phone, your mum's phone, any TV, actual TV, because yep. right? we bought him a toy yeah, TV. It's not, it's not the same. Yeah. And he could not give a fuck no. about that. Because right? the ad- they don't see the adults playing with it. I think that's what it yeah, is. Maybe. But he's got 150 toys. That The adults, you adults play with the toys. Yeah, but he likes the dustpan and brush. He, yep. he likes uh, the bag of recycling. Can I ask you a question? <laughs> Do any of your kids lose their shit? Zadie might be a bit different now because yeah. she's older and she can actually deep what's inside <laughs> But when they were young, when she was younger, does any of your kids lose their shit when the fridge or freezer opens? Oh, absolutely. No, like, she's, no she still likes to know what's going on. Oh, he yeah, crawls. But she's got a concept of that there's food inside. Yeah, there, yeah. yeah. But she's, well, yeah. it's just, a, oh, it's cold. My right. son don't know what's in the freezer. Right. If that thing even opens, he's like... <laughs> <laughs> Say what? He, and, it, and then he'll just sit in front of it. Well, like, you know, my son's got, got that infatuation where he just like he just sit, he I'll like, put him on mind, the, mind the end of the room mm. and go back to it and he's flying across the room. <laughs> he's just, just what's that? What's that? What's that? What's that? <laughs> and says what's that so much, bro? After a certain amount of time, you're just like a door. <laughs> <laughs> I've told you this so many times. There's good food in here. It's a door. But I think, no, my, like, he, when he sees it it's open, he does, he gets into his crawler, he just starts yeah. speeding with the crawler. Do, 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 then he starts pulling himself up while trying to hang on to, like, the, the shelves in and stuff like that. It's like, come on, like, calm down, relax, mm-hmm. relax, relax. But, yeah, there is that sort of excitement. I mean, he just has to get into stuff. Like, it's probably like your I think he's too. like, this is cold, but I don't know what cold is. Mm. But I want to sit here. And experience it some more. Mm. And experience it some more. But I had to get um jaw locks. Oh yeah. Because this boy kept opening the jaw and then shutting his finger in it. Good, oh. that's fun, isn't it? Yeah. But what? you'd think three times. You think you'd learn from you'd it? To go, I'm yeah, the pain response. Because that's the thing, I can't even get mad at Zadie because she loves to slam a cupboard door, slam a drawer. Uh, but she's never got her fingers caught. Mm. Mm. But I keep watching it going, it's going to happen. One day, yeah. It's it's literally that. And just, just that last minute, just bam. Mm. And then Darren's going to be like this. And I'm looking at her. <laughs> and she's like, in her mind, hand was it, wasn't even close to getting caught. In, yeah, in her yeah, mind, yeah, yeah, she's yeah. like, bam. Uh, just walks off. I'm like, oh my God. Just something in my head. Saying, We're going to AD. We're going to AD. We're going to AD. She's going to smash her fingers. She's gonna... <laughs> but yeah. But you'd think if you actually got them caught, well, he doesn't. Slam, I understand yeah. her arrogance. He <laughs> doesn't slam it hard, <laughs> but like he pushes it in, and then obviously, man's like just forgetting his fingers are there, so it's just it's just trapped in between the top drawer and the drawer he's opened, and then he's just like <laughs> looking around for a little while, and he's like, <laughs> and I'm like no. again. <laughs> Are you watching it the whole way, or when? No, when I'm do like, you see? I'm like at when the counter, I'm making a tea or whatever. <laughs> And the, he's doing this. Sour, do you? Room, doom, room, doom. Then after a second, you go, I haven't heard of room doom in a, in a hot yep. second. Yeah, so yeah, then you yeah, look yeah. down and he's just looking at you. And I'm like, what? <laughs> and then you look a bit further, you're like, oh. And then he's like, uh. And I'm like, <laughs> it didn't hurt until I looked at it. What are you capping for? <laughs> I, I, don't, I don't. Maybe this is the only thing they don't oh have to use their hands. Because like, when I try, I can't dress my son. Because he just likes to do this with his hands. 
when they ever tried to put a sleeve on him. Oh. So Eddie Trouble was just, his hands yeah. just there. Oh, and yeah, I was yeah, like, yeah, shut yeah. your hands. <laughs> and what I do. Like, Why are you doing Edward Scissorhands uh, with his hands? Uh, and it's just this, uh, uh, now he wants it in his mouth. Uh, so he's now, he's like, the sleeve's like this. He's, <laughs> so it's, you're so jarring. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's I put my hand, I'll I'll meet his hand yeah, in the sleeve. Put, yeah, put it mm. and, and just, there we go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you're not doing that fuckery today. Yeah, it's long, yeah. fam. It's no. long. I've got to start thinking, where's your thumb? Oh, I hope your thumb don't get pulled back. <laughs> but that's what these kids be doing, man. I've got a segue. Because of, cause of uh, you're talking about providing a safe environment. Yeah, 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 for sure. So, I've got a question for you guys. I saw on the internet, what is the most important factor in parenting? Is it A, love and affection? B, discipline and rules? C, Provided a safe environment, or D, transmitting cultural values. Oh, so A A is love, B is rules. discipline and the rules. rules. Uh, C is providing a safe environment. safe environment to thrive, and D is cultural values. Yeah. Cultural values. Now, anyone listening and anyone in the room, don't say anything fucking dumb. Like all four are important. We know that. That's the whole yeah. point. Of the <laughs> I hate that. I can't shit. really decide. Yeah, like, it's all you know, of them. It's a bit of all. Oh, wow. All you, of the above. Yeah, you said something really insightful there. <laughs> interesting so pick one they're obviously all important but yes if you had to I, I, do, do you know or what or rank up if you want okay let's rank let's rank do you want to do you want to see if we come to a consensus or we're going to do four in, uh, three individuals wait because this is definitely why you need like two parents let's write let's 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 oh, go okay let's but, go and um we'll do individ- write a list individually okay yeah. let's individually write, write a list, a list. and come, so you, come you, got, you got the photo you got the list there I phone. just remember it in my head. Oh, all right. Yeah. All right, sorry. Didn't know you had a memory. That's right, I've done it. Sorry, mate. Yeah, sorry, I've done it. I've done, I've done, right. I've done um, an hour before as well. Ooh, I can't remember things. See, it's mad because like that that one, like one of them in my head immediately has to go to the bottom because it's just in context of the other things, it's not that deep. <laughs> mm. But it is. So that I can do the least important. Oh, fair enough. Alright, man. It was yeah. close. So, one more typing it out like there isn't a letter right next to it. Dickhead. Alright. Uh, Alright. I think I've done it. Yeah, I've, I've got mine. But I think, are, are we allowed, like, um,. What? Like a steward's inquiry, like kind of like yeah, to say, like, boom, like yeah, these yeah. two might be interchangeable. Yeah, like. yeah, 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 yeah. Love that. Thanks, guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, fuck. Yeah, this is. I guess it's my most balanced. I, I was a bit. I wanted to be a bit contro. All right, so we'll go go a bit different. We'll go. Right? We're going to say what, what our least important one is. Yeah, let's do least important. Let's let's do it backwards. So right. fourth in last place. Sugar not first. I'll, I'll go first. Okay. It feels fucked. I know what you're going to say! Transmitting cultural values. <laughs> oh, you put that last. Yeah. So you don't care if Zadie don't know that she's from <laughs> the, the, the Yardland, Jamaica, Kingston. You don't give a damn. You want her to know that she's from Hearts. She is. She's from Hertfordshire. Oh, <laughs> my goodness. I've got the same... Huh? I got the same. It, it, you guys don't give a damn. It, we're in the, in the context, yeah, we're, we're finished. In the context, we're losing recipes. Can I say this? Can we're I... losing <laughs> recipes. <laughs> Doctor Uma will be ashamed of both fuck of you, Dr. brother. Doctor Uma, bro. Of both of you, brothers. I'm gonna fuck about Doctor Uma. <laughs> you, you just come back from your BBL. What's, what's hey yours? man, wait, 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 can I just say consciousness over consciousness? Can I just say? Oh, 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 oh his body's first. Consciousness over the coochie. I want to. I want to just go back to what he said to us. Yeah, it's in our top four. Alright. Yeah, yeah, is it our top four? It's in our top, it, top it, Yeah, by by default. Go ahead. So what's your what's yours? My last one. Yeah. Uh <laughs> Big discipline. Niger man, love and affection. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> <laughs> love and affection. <laughs> what am I affe- what am I affecting? Why do I need to affection? I can get love another button. <laughs> what am I loving? Hey, that took me out. <laughs> Uh, no, I hit you whack. Uh, surprisingly, uh, discipline. 
Ooh, discipline the lowest. What? Uh, are you really African, bro? What are you talking yeah, about? Yeah. We're losing recipes. Fam, yeah. if you put discipline last as discipline a Nigerian last. man, yeah, that's that it. means by default, yeah. cultural values <laughs> last as well. <laughs> No, 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 no. Am you're, I you're lying? Insane. If I'm lying, so I'm dying. Yeah, well, then you're, then you're dead. <laughs> no. Because you're, you're, you, can't say, you can't say to me after that. That's a cultural... Is, is that's a cultural discipline. Thing, but it's one of your cultural... Who are you? You keep flipping. You keep flipping. This episode Cuzzy, I'm flip. Chipmunk. <laughs> who, I don't know who you are. You need to stay... I'm going to do a DNA a shape, test on I'm you. I'm a shapeshifter, bro. You just... I haven't had you flip-flopped in one episode. So you got Every time I get my willy out. Yeah. We've got transmitted cultural values. So why, why is cultural, cu- transmitting cultural values not important? Or, <laughs> okay, not, least no, important. Yeah, Jesus. Least wait, important. You Piers Morgan. What's going on? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> See, I'm good at this shit. Why is it not important? Who said it wasn't important? Well, you ranked it last, didn't you? Uh, yeah, but, um, tra- yeah, transmit. No, it's not the least important. It's just out of the other three things. Out of the four things. But, um, I don't know. Although, I guess because as long as your kid, you know, is a well-rounded person, do they need to like the food that from our country? Do they need to know the music from my country? Do they need to know, but it, where, so, do they need to know where we're from? And so, like, in the context of they're well-disciplined, they're well-rounded, they're well-loved, they're, uh, they're safe. These, these recipes are hot damn gone, fam. Mm-hmm. What about you? What's, what's your what's your what's and your plus excuse? plus even if it's not me transmitting cultural values, they can get cultural values from outside. We're in fucking Britain, Mike. Yeah. Jeez, I'm you want to do the EDL? I'm joking, nah, man. Um, my reason is because, bro, it didn't really happen to me. Mm. Was it really like my granddad's Nigerian? My nan was English. What do you feel, what do you feel you are like what like who who like who is Kazim? I don't know British. No, no. <laughs> put it this way. Like let's put it this way. Okay, these are my values. Yeah. <laughs> if England play Nigeria, I root for Nigeria. Yeah. Okay. If Tyson Fury fights Anthony Joshua, whether I like Anthony Joshua or not, I root for Anthony Joshua. Okay. Yeah. So, whatever the thing is, yeah, I always want to see the, I want to always want to see the the black person win. Right. Okay. Yeah. Um, apart from that one, <laughs> Anthony Joshua lost, and I laughed. Uh, <laughs> anyway, um, but yeah, I didn't really have that trickle down effect. I'll go to my granddad's house. Yes, he'd be playing like fellow Kuti and whatnot, but you were really messing with it. We d- no, it's n- it's it's not like that was every time, and you know, there was a lot of African Nigerian things going on in the household. Mm. Like for example, none of my mum and none of her siblings can speak Yoruba. Mm. Yeah, I only know what I know through my own yeah. te- yeah, teaching yeah, myself. And yeah? We had some of the food, but mm. not all of the food. Mm. Yeah, like we had. Bits and bobs, but then obviously we then also had Sunday roast because my name was English. And then like when I'd go to my dad's side of the family, like one out, I'd I'd already feel like an outsider there because they'd see each other all the time, mm. and I'd just be there sporadically, mm. you know. Um, when my mum would take me or so, and then like the food, yes, the music. My mum would play in the car, and she would say, "This is your roots and stuff like that." <laughs> Like this is like this is p- like part of your where you come from, um, but again, like I think especially in a Caribbean household, yeah. the the values are almost, within the house. Yeah, and do what, and things. A lot of Caribbean values are are actually inherited from Europe anyway. In what sense? Like what ones? I don't. Know, it's just like. I don't know, maybe and maybe someone listening can come pull me up and I'm wrong. But it's like I don't in my head, Caribbean culture is a mix of different cultures anyway, but it's mixed with like European, bit of African. But yeah, it's nice, it's kind of, it's, it's very like colonial and stuff. And mm. what what how how to behave proper mm. is literally just what the English brought over mm. 
it's all about respectability and all that kind of thing, then that's that's behaviour wise. Then outside that, food, music. That's about. That's that's. Dancing, you can jerk some chicken. Dancing, that's, but that's that's that comes that's hand in hand with the music. Yeah, he's, yeah. The it's African up. stuff, like, bro, if you about to tell me something... Like, we, don't like, have look, a, we don't have another language, so we speak English anyway, you see what I mean? Yeah, well, I guess, like, I guess the Patois is... Yeah, like, I think if it was a thing of, like, we really had a full different language, mm. and because I think when you have a different language, your world view is different, because there's some words that yeah, yeah, you can't, exist don't translate in that language, and, like that. And, and because of that, it affects the way you see the world. Yeah. I think that makes your culture richer. Yeah, yeah, no, absolutely. So if your language it's, it's, it's is a specific thing, yeah. That's so yours if your language is already like English and it's this kind of thing of, of those like, yeah, I don't, it's, it's hard to explain. It's hard to. Well, you're saying it's just hard to differentiate. Yeah, completely. Kind of, yeah, but I think on the whole, it's quite intertwined. I think mm. on the whole, yeah, which is actually more passed down through the generations. Yeah, is um just black culture in general. Mm. Yeah. So we're all brought up to do certain things, yeah? Mm. So if I meet your mum, mm. I meet your mum, mm. it's auntie straight away. Mm. I'm taking my shoes off. I'm greeting everyone in the house. I'm not just going to just yeah. roll in, you know what I'm saying? Mm. Um, you know, uh, it's, man- <laughs> it's manners and respect, yeah? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm trying yeah, to say yeah. f- certain things that are coming from the African side. Like, I would try and remember for my granddad, but to not um, um, take anything with your left hand. Yeah. And even now when I see my granddad, I don't know if he sees it, but I give him a little like yeah. like little little bow like that. You get yeah. me? Um you know, but like there's certain things within I'd say the black culture in general that have just cascaded down. Mm. And that's probably what like certain things, you know, are like ask before you take something. Right. See what I'm saying? Like, just like I just remember my mom just being like, just don't open, just don't open shit. Like, ask mm. before you take something. Yeah. When you go to somebody's house, don't ask for nothing. Mm. That kind of stuff. You're not hungry. You're full. It's fine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Tommy go, rambling. It's a bit different as well, cause like, but like I think I mentioned this before, but in terms of like finances and stuff like, but still, when we go in the shop, don't ask me for nothing. Yeah. Mm. yeah. We've got toast at home. Hey, hey. That kind of... There's always yeah. toast at home. Things where you could go to pretty much any black person and go, yeah, we all had that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think there's Even universal. things down to like... So like Cherie, yeah, will we'll dash something out ASAP. <clears throat> I'm like, stick that in a Tupperwares and put that in somewhere or the, the Neapolitan... Yeah. Fr- mm. the, we're saving that. Yeah. She's like... But it's been two days. I'm t- I'm saying I'm telling you that's good. Yeah, that is good. <laughs> we can Don't still worry. use that. But can... four hours past eating it, Sheree's like, "This has got to go." Yeah, I'm what? like, I'm eating. Left, that. you shouldn't do leftovers. <laughs> I'm eating that tomorrow. Yeah, no, this is getting like more used to me as well. Being like, we can, we I left that for you because. I know she would say something sarcastic because I know you want to eat like next year or something. <laughs> 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 but the Tupperwares, the, the, the uh, it's hard to explain, but just like the small stuff of it's going to sound so dumb, but being able to be in a function and eat off a paper plate standing up. <laughs> 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 See what I'm saying, bro? Yeah, there, there, there's some cultural things that that yeah. you're not taught. You just see and then you do. You yeah, know, yeah, 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 yeah. You yeah, get yeah. me, so like, yeah, yeah. man. So you also say discipline. You have put that. That I think you, at you least important. You throw discipline out the window. Yeah, I threw it out the window, man. I think I think your child obviously through if you give them a love, love and affection, you provide them with a safe environment. I would like to think they will understand that they got acts right. I would yeah. like to think, but I wouldn't. I'd rather my child love me than fear me. So that's why I've ranked discipline. But I don't think one. fear comes with discipline. I think it can be misconstrued. I think yeah, it, it can, depends on yeah. how you do it. Yeah, of course. If but you then show, it, choose to discipline through fear. But I think people, some some households, if you're brought up where like, fuck, if I do this, I, I'm going to get absolute in trouble. Or if it's like military yeah, training. Yeah, like you da, da, da. should have that voice in your head, right? If you've been disciplined well. 
Like, but even, I had like, that even, voice in my head and I still fucked around. Yeah, but but uh, yeah, it's not, it's not, it's but not that's the thing. Always gonna work. It's no, consequences but are. there is a difference between fucking up and knowing, oh, if my mum finds out this, I am fucked. But I'm yeah. still doing it. I just need to be sneaky with it. Yeah. Versus, I don't give a fuck what happens. I'm doing yeah, what that's I want. True. Mm. Crazy stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> you know no, I mean? someone, just... that, someone that can veer off track, someone that's completely off yeah, track. Yeah, just isn't fears it? nothing. Yeah. Like, yeah. you're trying to explain to you know what you did was wrong. They're like, don't care. No, yeah. That person that person's cannot that person's, be saved. That person's destined for prison. <laughs> they're just destined. They're destined for prison, that person. Whereas the person <sighs> who just fucking about, you can go, they're young. They're yeah, young. They're yeah, just yeah. Wrong. They they need to be sat down again and again and they just like okay yeah no it's it's in my head now <laughs> it's in my head. yeah or they need to watch something really bad happen to their friend they'd be like okay, and then oh shit yeah, yeah 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 whereas that other guy is just like not me never that yeah mm. never 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 that and so that that's why I ranked it there mm. um, yeah what's your third one my third one is uh, cultural values actually. Am I a dickhead, bruv? What? <laughs> are we dickheads? The what, funny, where did you actually... Wait, I ranked it. Are we mugs? The funny thing is, my third one is discipline. <laughs> <laughs> Same. <laughs> Same. But also... We're not far off. How have you gone that buck wild on us? The recipes are... are we're no, losing no, no, recipes. We are losing recipes. We're losing <laughs> recipes. We're losing recipes. And losing... you have it... Second to last, we, we are with the recipes. That needs to be for your reaction. That needs to be number one. No way. <laughs> I said no way. No way. <laughs> Culture no can't way. be above everything. <laughs> Man, is everything. That's like going. That's like going. All right, we need to we need to do a vote on what happens to to criminals uh, that commit murder. Yeah. Yeah. And someone goes, "All right, um, me and Darren think." that they should get the death penalty. Yeah. And then you go, Mike, what do you think? You go, no, nah, not the death penalty. You go, nah, nah, what are you and skunks, bro? That's yeah. inhumane. What are you, that's inhumane. Yeah, what are you yeah, doing? yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't... What are you doing? The death Rehabilitation penalty. them, them people. You, what, and then we go, all right, so what would you rank? It? And you go, and then you go, oh, um, I think we should just torture them for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, keep them alive, though. Keeping them alive, though. What's a chance of rehabilitation. Yeah, exactly. But I, so I've gone for discipline rules as my third. You've got if we've got ours matched. So, matched. Okay. So we we don't really I, need to I explain why we've got those. Put yeah, 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 yeah. We've, we've done. I think that. after this year, after now, I know yours is discipline. Your yeah. second to last one is your third one. Basically, is discipline. Yeah. yeah, and mine is as well. I think there's only one out. I think we've matched. Interesting. Like hinge. I, uh, so my second one was, uh, safe environment. Safe environment. Oh, we didn't match. Oh, well, you got, you got love and affection. Oh, so you think, so you think safe environment is paramount? I mean, it does make a lot of sense. It, it does. <laughs> All I, of it I, makes I switch, sense. If the environment my is yeah. not safe, then I cannot love and give you affection. I hear that. But then let's say you're like a pursuit happiness thing, you're just broke, like down yeah. on your luck. You're, you, you ain't saying the bone density machines. Yeah, like, yeah. So if you, what, if, you see, <laughs> if you see that film, there is probably some neglect of love and affection until my man makes it. He's doing true. everything no, for his... <laughs> neglect. <laughs> <laughs> several different versions of neglect, but he's not able to give... I would. Well, For when I'm in the homeless shelter, that's what I'm calling back my ex guy. Yeah, take your son, man. Yeah. I, I've got him sleep. I've got sleep in, in train station toilets. <laughs> and hey, that's a son that's willing to grind, though. Yeah. That's a son, That's a real ride or die son. You got to respect bro, it. That, but that he was, was down for the course. I haven't, watched, dude, I haven't watched that film as a parent. Yeah. I yeah. watched it when I was at uni and it made me cry. Yeah. So. Patreon I, special, watch like, along. Seven pounds made me cry. I see. Problem with seven pounds is I was told it was going to make me cry. Oh, but so you already in the mindset. So, yeah, so, uh, and it's annoying because I was like, oh, I get it. Like, it w- may have moved me, but I never knew because I was just watching it going, nah. Where is it? And who's the patient? It's me. <laughs> <laughs> see, my pursuit of is two scenes. It was the toilet in the, in the train station. Yeah. The stuff. 
I was I, that, when he gets the job. Mm. Yeah, finally. Thank you. Do you know what made me cry? Oh, stop. <laughs> hey, that's real acting, man. That's Kara- real acting. Karate kid. Oh, yeah? I hate it here. That bit got me. <laughs> I want to go home. Yeah, so I put uh, love and affection a second because mm. in order to me to give you yeah. the utmost love and affection, I need to ensure that you're in a safe environment because if you're not in a safe environment, then God knows what will happen and I might not be able to give you love and affection. Do you think someone can, you can, someone can love their child even if they're in a dire situation where they're not providing a safe environment? You can love them, but let's, okay, there's love mm. and then there's affection. So because it said love and affection, yeah, I've had to factor in affection. Yeah. Yeah. If I'm too worried about making sure that you're s- s- completely you're in a safe environment, mm. I ain't gonna have time to hug and play games and chuck yeah. you in the air and mm. make memories. We're in the toilet. Yeah, yeah me. We're stay. Got... We're in the toilet. We yeah, ain't got nowhere grinding. to live. Yeah, yeah. Dad, I want to hug. I want radiators. <laughs> <laughs> hey, <a> pillow. <laughs> It's tough out here, though. <laughs> it's tough but out love, here, though. love is just that's just um, it's it's undeniable, isn't it? Yeah, love's yeah. just love is undeniable. Yeah. So if I could split them, it would go love, safe, safe environment, right. affection. affection. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. Kind of that, not as deep, but kind of that scene from Fences. Why don't you like me? Who says I got to like you? I got to make sure you're you're safe. I got to make sure there's food on the table. I got to yeah. make sure this. Who says I have to like you? Of course, I like my son. I like yeah, my yeah. daughter. I know that stuff. But I'm just saying, I have to also make sure I have duty. a responsibility to make sure you are safe, you are well, you are fed, you are warm, you are clean. Your water, all that me. good stuff. You, nah. you, I got, to, I got to make sure you are happy before I am happy. That's true. Mm, selflessness. Yeah. There's Altruism. so many things I've got to do that encapsulate as well. I think a lot of these things also Venn diagram into each other. Like, yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, all yeah, of that. Of I do all of that stuff. Because I love you. Yeah. The affection comes also out of love. Yeah. But affection is ha- where you got time to do it. Almost. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's a it's a it's, it's affection a luxury then. I would say it's a luxury because basically me and my mum we are we weren't like in the, having an affectionate kind of like huggy kind of yeah yeah. yeah. So when I entered an environment like that. And people like wanted like stepped up with hugs and this is wanted hugs all the time and this and that. I was like, what the fuck is this, bro? Yeah. We got, oh. sh- we got shit to do. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe yeah. I'm gonna leave that for the next episode because there was this. I saw this TikTok which was talking about how you were how a man's relationship with his mother dictates his parents. That's yeah. That's next episode. Yeah, yeah that's next that's episode. Deep. So we'll, we'll we'll go into that in the next episode. All right. Um, let's let's all right. round up this one. Uh, that's been another episode of Late Nights and Wet Wipes. I've been your co-host, Michael Akadiri. To the left has been... Oh, you done know. Kazin Jamal, a.k.a. Thomas Gangley, a.k.a. Leader the Peaky Bumble Class, a.k.a. Nines and Potter Papers Younger. Just call me Nine Piece of Paper. But if you see me in Halston, just call me 4.5. Big enough, small he big he every time. <laughs> you done know. He's so confused. So he'd be big enough. Two ends in London. One in Birmingham. One in Birmingham. Two in Birmingham. <laughs> And he's saying that he ain't got beef with no one. Hey, I've got man. beef with no one. I love everybody, but hey. not before I ensure. Love, but not something but, like Diddy at it. Not, hey. not before I ensure <laughs> that Whoa. they are safe. Whoa, they are in a safe environment. Whoa, and please never ever. Whoa, allude. To me. Hey, that's his word though. Love. <laughs> that's not Whoa. his word. <laughs> Whoa, it's a word Whoa. that he uses. Yeah. Whoa. He, was, he also said. Can't stop, won't stop, and that's why he had a case. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Okay, <laughs> that's, that's, all right. Okay, you said well, bleep, a, bleep, bleep that. Well, I was going to talk. I'm after not this. bleeping that. No, bleeping that out. I'm not. Bleeping no, that. I think I was, I was having to keep it in. Keep it in. That's what Diddy <laughs> said as well. Okay. Ask your bill payers permission. Who's <laughs> that? Is me, Darren G, Darren Griffiths. It's the end of the pod. Baby, tell me if you like 